Okay, so how to write an equation for the linear function f with the given values f of 3 equals 7 and f of 4 equal, equals 12. First thing you have to note is that the number in brackets is represents x and the number over here represents y. So same thing here, 4 is x and 12 is y because we know that f of x equals y so this is the form those uh, this data is written in and how to solve this i'm going to share the screen okay so um here we have uh same thing written out so I just gave them indexes. So for the first data, f of 3 equals 7, I put it x1 equals 3 and then y1 equals 7. And for the next one, f of 4 equals, equals 12, which means that x2 equals uh, 4 and y2 equals 12. And then from them, we form dots. So x1 uh, and y1 uh, um, give us a dot 3 comma 7. And x2 and y2 give us a a dot with uh, data 4 comma 12. So now we have two dots and we basically need to create a function between two dots for which we're going to use the point slope form of the function which is y minus y1 equals m which is slope times x minus x1. Uh, first we're going to solve for slope. Slope has the formula delta y divided by delta x. Delta y means y2 minus y1 and delta x means x2 minus x1. So we're just going to put this data in it. So y2 is 12, 12 minus y1 is 7, 7, x2 is 4 minus x1 uh, is 3. Uh, be careful here so you don't put wrong numbers, which gives us that a slope is Five. Okay, so now that we have slope, we're just going to put all the information in this point slope form. Uh, y and x stay y and x, we need those. So instead of y1, we're going to insert here 7, m is 5, and then instead of x1, we're going to insert 3. Everything else we're just going to copy. So we're copying this equation over here. We have y minus 7 equals 5 times x minus 3, and we just want to have it in the form y equals something x plus minus something which means that we're going to solve this 5 times x is 5x minus 5 times 3 is 15. Uh, then you want to uh, remove this 7 because you want to have y on the left side by itself. So you add 7 to both sides and then you get y equals 5x minus 8. And then you just rewrite y, which is uh, just another word for f of x. And our, our final answer is f of x equals 5x minus 8. If you have any questions, feel free to contact me.